Hello and welcome to the Albert S. Cook Library. This video will show you how you can access articles, ebooks, videos, and other electronic resources from off campus. There are a few methods you can use to get signed in. First, from the library homepage, select Sign In from the top right corner. Select Off Campus Sign In from the top menu. The page will then reload. If you check the URL and it now has proxy-tu in it, you have successfully signed in. You are now able to access any of our databases and other electronic resources. The next way to sign in is through Cook One Search, the large search bar on the library homepage. First, type in your search. This could be keywords related to your topic or the name of an article, book, or other item you want to access. After you search, a yellow banner will appear that says, sign in to get complete results and to request items. Select the sign in link. You will see a menu with two options. Select the one that says Towson students and staff. You will be prompted to log in with your TU net ID and password, the same ones that you use to get into Blackboard and your Towson email. You will now be able to see some additional items in your search that did not appear before. You will also have the ability to request items from other libraries. Additionally, signing in will allow you to save your searches, personalize your search results, and access your user account in order to see what you have checked out and renew items. The final method of getting access to off-campus resources is with the Reload at TU button. The Reload at TU button allows you to get quick access to articles you find through Google Scholar or other places outside of the library. If we subscribe to the item, the button will give you access. To add the Reload at TU button to your web browser, start from the library homepage. Then, in the gold navigation menu under Get Help, select how to start your research. Select Access Resources from Off Campus from the list of options. Follow the instructions on this page for your preferred web browser. If you are using Firefox or Chrome, you can simply drag the button into the top of your browser to add it as a bookmark. Then, if you ever come across an article that you can't access, click on the Reload at TU button. If it's something we subscribe to, you will be able to read the full text of the article after you refresh the page. Here's an example of an article that is telling me I need to pay in order to access the full text. I can see if Cook Library has it by clicking on the Reload at TU button in my browser. First, I need to sign in with my TU username and password. Now it has reloaded the page and I can see the full text of the article when I couldn't before. Please note that the Reload at TU button will only work for items we subscribe to at Cook Library, so it will not work for every article, book chapter, or other media you may come across. Remember that you can always request items we don't have through interlibrary loan. Have questions? We have answers. Visit bit.ly slash tu ask a librarian for details on how to contact a librarian through chat, email, call, text, or individual appointment. Happy researching!